Yo, what's going on guys? It's your boy Cyanide here, back again with another GTA 5 Online video. And in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to get the colored joggers and the CEO armor without losing any of your outfits after the latest patch on 1.50. But before I start the video, keep in mind, this glitch only works for the PS4 once again. If it works for the Xbox, let me know in the comment section down below so other people can know that it actually works. So yeah guys, and also I want to keep you guys updated about the giveaway. The giveaway is still running. And once again, if you guys want to go ahead and register for that giveaway, click the link in the description down below and it will direct you to that website. And all you guys have to do is follow the simple steps to be registered. And I believe you guys have about four to five days left before that giveaway ends. So if you guys haven't already, go ahead and click that link in the description down below and register before it's too late. And also I want to give a quick shout out to everybody who has been showing me support on my channel lately. You know, I really appreciate everybody who has been subscribing. And if you guys haven't already subscribed and if you guys enjoy modded outfits or enjoy my content what are you guys waiting for go ahead and click that you know subscribe button as it does help out the channel so yeah guys with that being said let's get straight into the video all right so the first thing you guys want to do you just want to make your way over to any online session and now from there make sure you guys are appearing online and once you guys have made sure you guys have those two things you guys want to press options now from there go to online scroll down to playlist and then go to create and now from there scroll down to add race so go ahead and click on it and now from there scroll down until you see criminal records once you see it, press X and it should be added to the playlist. Now from there, press circle and then scroll down to save playlist. And now from here, you know, name the playlist, anything you guys want. So go ahead and name it. So boom, just wait for this screen to, to disappear. And now from there, scroll back up to my playlist and your playlist should be right there, the one that you guys created. So make sure that, you know, the race is inside the playlist and then you start it up. So once you guys launch the, you know, the playlist, you guys are going to be teleported over there by Sandy Shores next to the, you know, the prison. And also, please make sure that you guys are appearing online or else the playlist will not pop up for you. So yeah, once you guys are right here, you guys want to keep the race type standard. And, you know, just bring down the number of laps to one. And now from here, it doesn't matter. You guys could do this solo. You guys don't have to invite a friend or anybody random. So simply start up the, start up the job. And also, don't worry about the matchmaking right now. So once again, go ahead and, you know, launch the mission on your own. And once you guys had loaded in, you guys are going to have to finish the, you know, you guys are going to have to do the whole race. So I'll see you guys when I'm done with the race. So once you're done with the race, you know, simply press like and now from there, press X to continue. And now it's going to load you back into the session. So I'll see you guys when I'm back online. So once you're back online, the first thing you guys want to do is want to go ahead and press options. Now from there, go to online and scroll down to options. And now scroll down, scroll down to see matchmaking and make sure you set it as closed, all right? So once you guys have set it to closed, go ahead and press the, you know, the PS4 button. And now scroll down to activities and find the playlist that we just created. So once you guys have found it, it should be this one right here. I named it part two. So go ahead and click X on it. And now hover over join playlist and double tap the PS4 button. And once you guys have done that, you guys should be back on GTA. But if the recent activity didn't pop up on your screen, you guys got to go to your profile and go to recent activities and it should be there. So now once you guys are back in GTA, you guys want to press options, go to online, go to jobs, rocks are created, and start up an adversary mode that I'm about to show you guys. So yeah, scroll all the way down and scroll back up until you see this one right here. I'm going to fast forward this part because, you know, it took me a while to find it. So I'll see you guys when I found it. So once you guys had it kept on scrolling, it should be this one right here. Make sure it's the first one. And now from there, press X to start up the job. And also make sure that you guys close your matchmaking because if you guys didn't, this glitch will not work for you. So yeah, make sure you guys go ahead and start it up. And now from there, put first one to win, one round. And now set the you know the time to five minutes and the target score to 200. Now from here, go ahead and invite a friend or somebody random. But once again, I recommend doing this with a friend because he's gonna have to you know listen to you so he can help you out. So yeah, guys, I'll see you guys when my friend has joined me. So as soon as somebody joins you, go ahead and launch the mission. And also shout out to the people who joined me to help me out with this glitch. So now from here, join the team that you guys want the colored joggers from. So as you guys can see, I'm going to be getting the orange joggers in this video. So yeah, you guys could get purple joggers or orange joggers with the CEO vest by doing this glitch, okay? So go ahead and tell your friends to ready up so the launch, you know, so the mission can launch, I mean. So yeah, I'll see you guys when I'm inside. Alright, so once you guys are inside the mission, you guys want to do the same thing that I do to kill time, alright? 
so basically this this part right here is simple so now from here make your way over to the objectives which is a b and c and all you guys will have to do you know just stand inside it and then you know just wait for the thing to fill up so as you guys can see i'm about to go right now like i'm telling you guys yes you know i recommend doing this with the friend so they won't kill you so yeah once you guys are right here go inside the circle and as you guys can see there's going to be like a bottom right corner bar filling up just wait for that to fill up and simply walk away and now from here do it for the other objectives to b and c so as you guys can see my teammate captured um b so i'm gonna go to c So once you guys are on C, you guys are going to do the same thing. Just stand there, wait for it to fill up. So once all three are filled up, now right here, you guys are going to have to wait in one circle. And just wait for the, you know, the top score to go up to 200. So as you guys can see, I'm at 32 right now. And, you know, just wait for that to fill up to 200 so the mission could be over. So now from here, it's, you know, it's, you know simply the waiting game. So I'll see you guys when this job is over. All right, so as soon as you guys are done with the job, you guys are going to have to, you know, carefully pay attention. So now from here, like this job, and as soon as your teammate clicks on a different job, you guys are going to have to click replay. And now from here, wait for that bottom right corner timer to disappear, as you can see right here. So boom, as soon as it disappears, double tap your PlayStation button and, you know, click join playlist. And keep on doing that 10 times, okay? So double tap and join playlist and double tap and join playlist 10 times. And then once you guys have done that, you guys should spawn on the floor. And then, you know, you guys should get this alert. Once you guys get this alert, press circle to decline. And now from here, your character will be, you know, invisible. Now press options, go to online and go down to criminal starter pack. And, you know, just launch it and then back out. And then your character should be back. So now from there, open up your interaction menu, go to style, go to accessories and equip a pair of gloves. And now from here, you guys can either wait for the session to kick you out or you could just find a new session. So press options, go to online and find a new session. And now from here, I'll see you guys when I load it into that new session. So once you guys are back in that new session, you guys should still have the outfit. So as you guys can see right here, I still have it. So now from here, make your way over to the nearest clothing store that's located on your map. So as you guys can see, it's right there. So now I'm going to be making my way over there. So I'll see you guys when I had arrived. So once you guys had arrived at the clothing store, you just want to go to the front counter to save this outfit. So go to the front counter, press right on the D-pad, and then press square. And once you guys are saving it, please do not name this, uh, you know, this outfit joggers or anything related with joggers. Or else you guys will, you know, lose the outfit. Rockstar will, you know, remove any outfit that, you know, is named joggers, you know. So yeah, make sure you guys don't name it. And now for me, this part's optional. I'm going to be making a fast and simple outfit. So yeah, if you guys want to go ahead and make it, you know, just copy this in components. So yeah, go into the glove section, which is at the accessories, and put on the black tech gloves. And as you can see, it doesn't let you put on scarves. But, you know, to fix that, open up your interaction menu, go to style, go to accessories, and scroll down to scarves. You know, just hit left on the D-pad and equip the black desert scarf. And now from there, make your, make your way over to the shoes section. And also, quick, you know, quick disclaimer, it does not let you switch the sweater. So yeah, you guys are going to lose the CO armor if you guys switch the sweater. So I don't recommend doing that. So yeah. So yeah, make your way over to the shoe section, go to sports shoes, and you know, scroll all the way down and scroll back up until you see the all white sports shoes. It should be these right here. So go ahead and put these on. And now from there, open up your interaction menu, go to style, go to accessories, and equip a reef breather. So yeah, make sure you guys equip it. And now from there, make your way over to the hat section. And this helmet, it's optional. It's, you know, really pricey. It's like $90,000. So once again, it's optional. So yeah, go to the helmets. And then put on this one right here, the tiger. So go ahead and put it on. As you can see, it does really match with the outfit. You know, it's a simple and, you know, fast, you know, try hard outfit that you guys can make right on the spot. So go ahead and go to the front counter once again and save this outfit. I'm sorry. So boom, that's the orange one. And also, you guys could do this glitch again and get the, you know, the purple joggers. So yeah, I'll, I'm going to get the purple joggers and I'll see you guys. And, you know, I'll make a quick outfit once again. So I'll see you guys when I got the purple joggers. So once you have the purple joggers, go to the front counter and save it. But I already saved it, so from here, all I gotta do is go to the to this counter right here, which is accessories, and then go to gloves and put on the black tack gloves. Once you put those on, open up your interaction menu, and once again, equip the black desert scarf. So it should be this one right here, the black desert. Now from there, make your way over to the shoes section, and then scroll down to canvas shoes, and then scroll once again all the way down, 
So you see the all black canvas shoes. It should be these right here. Once you put those on, you guys are good to go. So now from there, open up your inter interaction menu, go to style, go to accessories, and equip the reef breather once again. And if you guys have the purple, you know, bulletproof helmet, you know, I recommend equipping that one. But yeah, if you guys don't know how to get those colored bulletproof helmets, I'll, you know, I'm gonna leave a video in the description down below. Go check out that video that I posted, and I did show you guys on how to get the colored joggers with the bulletproof helmets. So yeah, go check that out. And also, I added a parachute to this. So once you guys have the outfit done, go to the front counter and save it once again. So yeah, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this, you know, video. Let me know in the comment section down below if it worked for you. And also, let me know if it works on Xbox, because I'm not sure if it does. But if it does, let me know in the comment section down below. And before the video ends, I want to give a special shout out to one of my subscribers. He was nice enough to give me a bunch of modded cards for GTA. So, you know, I promised them a shout out on my next video, which is this one right here. So, yeah, go ahead and follow him on Instagram. And also, don't forget about the giveaway. If you guys want to go ahead and register for the giveaway, you guys have to click the link in the description down below and follow all steps to be registered. And you guys better do this quick before it's too late. So, yeah, guys, with that being said, it's been your boy Cyanide, and I'm out. Peace.